click subscribe and bell icon to get regular notifications. Diseases of the small intestine are difficult to diagnose and treat. Introducing a latest advanced technology power spirus enteroscopy in Yeshoda Hospital, Secunderabad. Joining with us Dr. Ravi Shankar, the consultant medical gastroenterologist from Yeshoda Hospital, Secunderabad. Doctor, tell us what is power spirus enteroscopy? Basically, the small intestine is difficult to visualize because it is long, tortuous and beyond the reach of the usual endoscopes. So we need something to visualize the small intestine. So basically we have been using capsule endoscopy technology and uh, somewhat not very long ago, balloon enteroscopies had come. So the time consumed by the balloon enteroscopies is much longer and it takes about more than one to two hours to visualize a small intestine. So a new technology has come up, which is called motorized power spirus enteroscopy. And this reduces the time of visualization to about 30 to 45 minutes. What kind of gastrointestinal diseases we can diagnose using this power spirus enteroscopy? Basically, it is a small intestinal disease that can be diagnosed by this power spirus enteroscopy and the usual lesions we can say is a bleeding lesion of the small intestine which is now beyond the reach of the endoscope and certain lesions like inflammatory conditions like Crohn's disease or rarely some tumors of the small intestine are the usual lesions that could be picked up by enteroscopy. What are the benefits for the patients where power spirus enteroscopy is used? Basically, the capsule endoscopy is diagnostic, whereas this could be therapeutic. That means we can reach the lesion, diagnose the lesion, and we can do some therapy with this power spirus enteroscope. We can pass instruments, pick up a biopsy, we can remove a foreign body, or we can stop the bleeding from a small intestinal lesions. Doctor, tell us what are the advantages for an interventional gastroenterologist like you using this latest equipment? There are two advantages. One is we can reach the lesion faster and then we can complete the therapy faster. So these are the two advantages when we use the power spirus enteroscopy. Well, this can be done with the balloon enteroscopes, but the balloon enteroscopes take a little longer time for intubation and it's a laborious process consuming a, a long time for the patient and also increasing the requirement of anesthesia for the patient. So power spirus enteroscopy is faster if you are able to do it properly and then we can reach the lesion, target it and do whatever is required for the benefit of the patient. Well, ideally if the lesion is somewhere around the jejunum where usually the commonest lesions of the small intestine are in the jejunum. That's the best uh, situation for us because uh, if the lesion is in the ileum, the reach of the enteroscope in the power spirus enteroscope may sometimes be difficult. So lesions in the jejunum are the best uh, indications for power spirus enteroscopy uh, because we can reach it much faster. But there are certain uh, situations which makes it uncomfortable for the operator as well as for the patient. These are post-operative patients and patients who have swallowing difficulties or some obstructions in the esophagus. Thank you so much.